hard is it for you to believe you are in this situation, waiting to hear who's going to start next Sunday? I don't find it hard to believe at all. Um, Coach is going to do whatever they feel is best for the team, so that's pretty much where it's at. <laughs> what can you – obviously, you've seen Marcus make plays, but you've also seen games like yesterday. Now, do you have a finger on what it is for this offense when it's going well versus a game like yesterday? Um, when it's going well, is we're just putting plays together. We're moving the ball, getting in the end zone. When it's not, we're doing the opposite. Three and out, giving the ball up, not making plays. Do, do you feel that's – fixable type of things? Or, I mean, is it, how frustrating is it to look at the film? Do you even recognize yourself? I think everything's fixable. Um, again, you know I mean? I just, uh, I hate to be that guy, you know, but uh, I just feel like people just got to take accountability and, and, and see if you're really doing your job. I mean, I'm going to do it. I'm, I'm looking at myself. I feel like I can do a better job. So hopefully everybody else is doing the same thing. Since training camp and practices and whatever, what's, what's Ryan shown that he has the ability to do that if he has the choice? But it's, it's I mean, Ryan was a, a elite quarterback in this league not, not long longer than a year ago. I mean, um, he can take over a team. He can make plays, um, control the offense. I mean, I, I've seen him do it in Miami. So um, I don't know what situation is going to be, uh, but soon enough we'll all find out. Mike said it was important to not have a, or he doesn't want a revolving door at quarterback, whatever he decides. Uh, how important is that? For whatever decision is made, that's the one they stick with and you guys do got this together. Um, I think uh, at the end of the day, like you say, you don't want to have uh, that flip-flop going back and forth. So whatever uh, decision they make, hopefully that's the best one. He talked about culture and having leaders you know, have to lead the way out of this. You're one of those leaders. What do you have to do this week? Make plays. I'm not the kind of guy that's going to yell. I'm not going to hoorah everybody, get them hyped up. I'm the dude that's going to make plays. So when them opportunities come, I'm going to make the play. And that's how I'm going to lead. Do you have enough other guys in this room that have that exact same attitude? I don't know. You know, I'm, I can only speak for myself. You know, you may want to ask these guys and, and see what type of attitude they have. The, the defensive guys have been very adamant over the last few weeks that you win and lose as a team. But they're giving up 15 points a game, and you guys are 2-4. and four. Do you feel like you've let them down? Our defense has been kicking butt, and that's pretty much where it's at. Defense has been kicking butt, you know what I mean? Um, every other group got to get up to that level. To remember it's only six games in, there's still a chance to turn things around? I mean, it's always a chance to turn things around. It's uh, just got to do it. You know what I mean? Uh, we can always talk about it, and I always say that, but you still got to play football. So uh, we want to change it, turn it around. So that's going to be the goal.